Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Arsenal facing Burnley. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, four goals in his last three appearances says it all, doesn't it, Derek? He's been absolutely outstanding. He's taken the chances to come his way, and he looks a real threat every time he gets the ball. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal get this game underway. This attack looks highly promising. Partey. Look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Chris Wood, Maxwell Cornet, Westwood, just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance, he must finish, and a goal it is, no long wait for the opener today. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So underway again here. One nil to score. Nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? McNeil. Brownhill. Ashley Westwood on the ball. Maxwell Cornet. Well, far from the ideal pass. Granite Jacker. Gabriel Martinelli. Now Lacazette. Plenty of options. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Lacazette Partey and moving the ball nicely Martinelli oh he's missed it well he'd be very disappointed with that he should be scoring from there Josh Brownhill. Chris Wood. He's using his strength to good effect. And the attack looks promising. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Gabriel. Ben White. Lacazette. Martinelli 
Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Johan Berg Goodwinson. Here's Tarkovsky. Maxwell Cornet. Nicely please cut out. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Lacazette! And the keeper got there. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? So the corner played into the box. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Partey. And very deftly cut out. Brownhill. Cornet has it. Well, Burnley aren't controlling the possession here. But what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. Partey. Good movement. Lacazette. And here's Partey. This could level it. Oh, he's missed it. He'll be kicking himself. Well, the opportunity presented itself, and they really should be level. They have to be more composed, more clinical if they want to get back into this. Well, here we are, moving close to half-time, and Arsenal chasing the game. Stuart, what have you made of their performance to this point? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attack in play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker, and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Couldn't keep the ball. Johan Berg, Goodwinson. And a tidy challenge. Partey. Now Lacazette. Martin Odegaard. Good technique displayed. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Ben Mee. Cornet has it. Westwood. Oh, he's given the ball away. Erdogan. Strong but fair tackle. Partey. And Lacazette. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Johan Berg, Goodwinson. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Saka. Thomas now. 
Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Martin Odegaard. Partey. Really good diving save. Here it is now, a substitution. Number nine, Alex Lacazette. Coming onto the pitch, number 14, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And over comes the corner. Oh, he would love to have that header back. to the final half hour superb defensive judgment to end the attack well as you can see Arsenal have had most of the ball but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative particularly in the wide areas up to this point they've been too easy to defend against over the touchline for a throw in Plenty of players waiting in the middle. It's opening up for them. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Maxwell Cornet. Good one, Son. And Chris Wood. Not to be this time. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Martin Erdegaard. Martinelli. An encouraging Arsenal move. Dangerous ball. Well, such a high degree of difficulty. Not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. And they will make the change now. Good strength to keep the ball. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Martin Odegaard. Partey. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Obama Yang. And a textbook interception. Charlie Taylor on to Tarkovsky. Well, when you can keep the ball like this, it's got to be really annoying for the other. Ten minutes to go. Well, just listen to these Arsenal fans. They're certainly driving their team. Scoreline against Arsenal, but still they're in this. Well, the corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game.
And they're making a change. Coming off the pitch, number 20, Maxwell Corley. Coming onto the pitch, number 19, Jay Rodriguez. Short corner it is. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Can they get in behind them? Now with Aubameyang. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Substitution time it is. Off the pitch, number seven, Lukayo Saka, to be replaced by number 19, Nicholas Pepe. He's driven in the corner. Glass it away. Chris Wood. Rodriguez with it. On and on he goes. Wood. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Martin Erdegaard. Nicola Pepe. They have to show a commitment to attack Arsenal in these trying circumstances. Chris Wood. Brownhill. So the referee's whistle means full time and it goes into the books as a defeat for Arsenal. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. I think it's accurate to say, Stuart, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.